guys, I'm Teresa and today I have a DIY picture frame project using pages of an old book. I basically printed silhouettes on pages of an old book that I had that had a brownish tint to it and then I bought these old beat up looking picture frames from the thrift store for like 50 cents each and it had that antique vibe to it which was what I was looking for. I'll also leave everything I used in this video in the description bar down below so if you're interested just keep watching. So to begin, start by searching some silhouette images online. Here I'm just searching up flower silhouettes. I think this is the best way you can find images that are black with a white background. And once you're happy with your choice, copy and paste it into Photoshop. You can use whatever software you're comfortable printing with. Just make sure you pick one side of the page and decide how large you want the image to be. Then you're almost ready for printing. Using some double-sided tape, I'm going to stick a page I got from my book onto an 85 by 11 piece of paper. And since my image is on the bottom right side of the paper, I gotta make sure that's where I stick it on for the image to print. Most printers print facing down and the bottom side first, so make sure you flip your page like I'm doing here, so the bottom is on the top now. And this will ensure the image to print where we want it to go. You may need to do a test print if your printer works differently though. And here I'm just taking the time to trim the edges and then you're ready for framing. I was lucky to find frames from the thrift store that were exactly the same but I think that if you found different ones but of the same size, that will work too. So here I'm just taking some double sided tape to make sure the pages stay in place and once you're done that, all you have to do is mount them on the wall. This is an easy way to decorate your space especially if you're on a budget. You can customize the silhouette images to your liking which I think is great too. So hope you try it out. Don't forget to like my videos if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel for more DIY videos in the future. Check out my previous video where I turned a wooden pallet into a coffee table over here. Thanks for watching guys and take care. <laughs>